Hey guys, EVP Man here, and in today's video, we're going to talk about how you can improve your work from home or study from home setup. We're taking a look at this 4K monitor from DeskLab that can connect to virtually any device, including your smartphone via USB-C or HDMI. Let's go ahead and check it out. Now in today's video, we're taking a look at the DeskLab touchscreen 4K monitor that allows you to either extend the display of your MacBook, MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, or any kind of Windows desktop or laptop. And for that matter, it could also work with the smartphone. So literally, as you look at it here, I am actually displaying via Dexed my Samsung Galaxy S20 uh, Ultra. So you see this view right here. This is actually what's going on behind me. This is my actual desk setup, but it's coming from my phone. And literally, it turns your phone into a DeX computer. Now, you could also have this connected to your Mac or your desktop and extend the display. Now, if you're working from home or studying from home like many of us are, having a second display really changes the overall efficiency and also your experience when, again, using these devices, especially with the work at home situation. So let's take a closer look at this monitor. We're going to look at all the features, uh, why you may want to consider something like this to extend and improve your home setup. Now, the very first thing we're going to take a look at is the monitor itself, and you can see how thin and ultra portable this is. So if you have a setup in your kitchen or you have a setup somewhere else, um, let's say even a bedroom, you don't have a lot of space, this monitor doesn't take up a lot of space. Look at how thin this thing is. If we flip this over right here, you'll notice that you have a couple buttons going on here. You have a power button, you have a little uh, rocker here. This is for your menu, and then you also have a headphone jack. On the very bottom, you do have some speakers, right? So you see your speakers there, and then you have these rubberized feet. Um, on this side, you have two USB-C, uh, micro USB, as well as an HDMI input. Now, before taking a closer look at the monitor and how I have it connected to my Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra, let's take a look at some of the menu settings here. So if you press the button here on the side, uh, you can see some of the controls that you have. You can increase the brightness, the contrast, go into eco mode. You have sharpness settings. Over here, you have the uh, color temperature, um, also hue, various settings here. You can turn on free sync if you'd like. You have volume as well. Uh, additional language settings as well as uh, rotating the display if you want to flip it upside down. Um, also if HDR is on or not. And then also how the input is going to be selected. So as you notice, it could go either to one of the two USB-Cs or go to HDMI or just auto select. Now let's talk about some of the setup options that you have. So I have this connected to my Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra as I mentioned, giving me DeX mode. But the next thing we're going to do is we're going to connect it to my MacBook Pro so you can see the difference. Now in this setup, I'm connecting my MacBook Pro directly to the desk lab, and you can see how it's mirroring the image from my MacBook Pro onto the monitor. Now what I would do normally is connect power going into the MacBook Pro, so that's fully powered, and then the MacBook Pro would power the monitor as you can see right here. Now keep in mind that while I can use these side by side without any problems, and you can see, I'll just move the, the pointer around so you can see how it's moving on the screen. Uh, one of the things that you have as limitation just with the Mac is the fact that the actual touch screen uh, will not work because it doesn't really have the drivers to support it. Now this next setup is with our Nintendo Switch. I uh, went ahead and connected the Switch docking station to the HDMI mini here and then powered it using the included uh, USB-C power adapter. Um, you can see here, this is the actual gameplay that we're getting. Really supersizes the experience when playing on a Nintendo Switch too. So guys, that wraps up our review of the DeskLab 4K touchscreen monitor.